I'm Martha Barnes, and uh, I live in Northville, and I'm a painter, <laughs> and I've been painting for 50 years, and uh, it's my life, I really, it's made all the difference in the world and the way I live. Uh, the first day I moved to Northville, uh, my neighbor, I had gotten to know her, and she said, uh, Martha, I'm going to art class today. Would you like to join me? That was in 1963. <laughs> and so uh, uh, I said, oh, I've always wanted to learn how to paint too. So I packed up and had my, you know, things all ready. I didn't have any equipment, you know, but um, I spent the day and I, I bought all this, you know, the paints that I needed, the brushes and all that. And I spent $26, and I thought that was a fortune in 1963. And uh, I had four boys at home and a husband, and I thought, this is really frivolous. I better make something out of this. <laughs> so I, uh, I've been painting ever since. And th this instructor, he wouldn't let you take your painting home. You had to do everything right there. So every week we went and painted on that one painting. It took me three months <laughs> to finish the painting. And I started out in, in oils. And then one day I went out in the, the field with some friends and we painted outside. And I finished the whole painting in one, you know, you, oils you have to let them dry and it's a procedure and uh, I thought oh this is wonderful and that I, I've been painting in acrylic ever since and watercolor too but something a little faster than oils and a little cleaner too because one day I was out in the field and I had my palette on my lap and the wind blew and I had a white shirt on and all those all that paint was all over me. It was a mess. Livonia Artists Club started in 1960, and they used to meet in houses. <laughs> uh, that was a long time ago. And finally, we moved to the, I wasn't in there then, but um, I was at Carl Sandburg. We moved there, and uh, we had our shows and our meetings there, and for years. And then they built this library, and we had a chance to come over here. Our shows at first were in the atrium, and um, everybody got too tired to bring their you know, easels and things, and it was a lot of work. So up here, the, everything is set up for us, and, and it's a very nice place to show. We have a, an October show. We have this show once a year, and it, it's going to be up here. And we have a, an un, it's called the unaffordable, or the affordable art show. <laughs> Everything is rather inexpensive. They're not framed, unframed pictures. And one girl does um, the Christmas balls, hand painted. And we have a few crafts too, but it, it's very nice and we have it downstairs here. And, um, and we have refreshments, and it's uh, usually Saturday and Sunday. And um, it's, it's wonderful. It's a casual art club, and we have a lot of fun. And uh, we get together and have lunch and do things like that. And it's just, and Anybody can join. You have to come to three meetings before you can show. And, uh, and after that, you're in. You don't have to be, you know, Rembrandt or anything to join the Livonia Artist Club. But it's, it's good to, uh, you know, have some background. And actually, if you just wanted to, if you're interested in art and just wanted to, to hear about it, and, and then, you know, we could get you into it. It's a learning experience. You learn to see things. Uh, I, 
After I started painting, I could see, I looked at every tree, I could identify every tree, and, and it's, it really is broadening. Before our show, we have a critique, and Al Weber is our godsend. <laughs> he critiques our paintings, and he's very good. And, uh, and then we have um, usually a video. We used to have an artist come in and do the program, but that got too expensive. So uh, now we us usually have videos of you know famous artists, and it's very informative too. They show the video, and then we discuss it afterwards. Sometimes, sometimes it runs too late and we all go home early <laughs> or late. And, uh, but, and we have had um, the old masters, you know, in uh, the Louvre in France and, you know, different uh, things like that too. But then modern artists too that uh, you can learn from. And, uh, once in a while we do have a, a demonstration. Somebody will, you know, do a painting or something like that. And, and that's always nice too. And it's the camaraderie of, of a club um, that we enjoy. And in May, the last meeting, we have a potluck. And uh, everybody brings passing dish and that's fun. We meet um, the third Monday of every month and uh, at 7 o'clock, so uh, we just meet once a month. We start in September and uh, then we're all done in, in May. So, so we need new members, so anybody would like to join, come on over. <laughs> it's. $20. I think it's $25 now. Um, and that's for the whole year. And then when we have our shows, um, I think it's uh, $20, $20 for the show. And we can have up to four paintings here. They are judged, but they're not juried in. So what you bring, you can show. And that's different than other, because we're a small club. If, if we were larger, we couldn't do that. They would have to be, some would have to be juried out, because there wouldn't be room to hang them here. Lynn Baum was our last judge, and she teaches at Schoolcraft. We um, usually get, you know, well-known artists around the area, and we usually get somebody that's qualified, and, and uh, Makes you feel good when you win. But we're happy for everybody when they win too, so there's no a lot of competition. <laughs> I heard that this judge, she wanted something a little different, something innovative. And that's what, because usually Yvette Goldberg, she's usually in charge of it. And uh, she usually asks them, and you know, how they judge a painting and how they feel about it. But she said the show was very nice and so that, that was good news. If you want more information, call the library or, or the city hall. They would know too, somebody at the desk because we've had our shows there too. In fact, we've shown oh, Laurel Park and quite a few other places too. That, so, we've been around for 53 years. <laughs> I think anybody who would like to join would have a nice time with us, and we would welcome them.